You needed to inflate that, didn't you? I inflate what? What else? That big puffy steel samurai! No, no, no! Why would I go ask me a question like that? Looks like I hit the nail on the head. Right, right. Actually, um... See, the compressor I always used was on the fritz. So I tried using the air tank to inflate it just once. And er, it didn't go so well. As I suspected. Ask more about the tank. It didn't go so well? Er, yeah! Do you think you could be more specific? Come on! Look, it's embarrassing, so I really don't want to talk about it. Tell us! Tell us! Fine. Whatever. It's like... What... I just happened with the busted compressor, so I took the air tank and tried to fill the samurai up with that, and then... BOOM! The valve busted open, and it made this incredible noise, and the tank there took off like a rocket, and took the, my poor deflated steel samurai with it. What? Off of the Gord Lake? I think I see what's going on now. It sure scared me out of my gourd, that's for sure. Da -na 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 -na. Um, so the tank and the steel samurai you were trying to fill up flew away. What happened next? Well, all that happened on the 20th or so. The 20th, a week ago. Now, as far as I could see, the tank went flying into the lake, so I went out every night in the boat to looking for it. I mean, Kianse gave me a steel samurai after all. And when did you find it? Just the night before last. It flew way out there. It took me a whole four days to find it. The night before last. The night of the murder! Sorry for not telling you, Nick. Actually, I was here at night of the murder. But you see, I went home before midnight. So, you didn't s know about what happened? No. That's too bad. It's not all that bad. We've solved one mystery, at least. A mystery? Maybe we should go tell her. Alright. So let's go ahead and go to the woods. Hey, y'all! Well, y'all find anything about Gordy? Um, no, nothing. Well, keep moving. It's cold out here at night time. It is a little chilly. I, I think I have to sneeze. Whoa! No, you don't! No sneezing! Watch you! This is just. <laughs> I told you, no sneezing! See, yes, I set my camera's response a little softer than a bang. I'd trigger one of those Von Karma's. It'd trigger on one of those Von Karma's snap finger snaps now. Oh, I'm sorry. Y'all, well, sorry, not nice about my film. Nick, pay the lady. Sob. All right. I learned something in today's trial for sure. Testifying is serious business. That's why I decided not to talk about that case anymore. Huh? Whoa. Didn't you say you had information about the case? Tell us that at least. Like I said, I'll trade it for dirt on Gordy. All right. Well, Mr. Lawyer, I've got info, all the info you need. Y'all need to find a scoop for me? All right. Gordy doesn't exist. Lada, there's no such thing as Gordy. Well, what? How y'all be so sure? Really, Nick? Y'all got some proof that Gordy doesn't exist? The proof that Gordy doesn't exist is... is right here. I have proof, of course. No lawyer worth his badge would make a claim without proof to back it up. Here's the proof that Gordy doesn't exist. Larry's air tank? What y'all doing with that air an air tank? This is Gordy. Um, excuse me? What exactly are you saying, Nick? There's a stand near here, the hot dog stand. A giant inflatable samurai doll there. About a week ago, an idiot, who happens to be a friend of mine, tried to fill it. He used an air tank, and when the valve blew, the tank flew into the lake. Apparently, it made a loud bang when it flew. A bang? The tank, along with the still-deflated samurai, fell into the lake. At the same time... Oh, a couple week was taking a photograph of the lake. This photo. Wait! So, you're saying that Gordy is really the steel samurai? 
Well, that's a fun way to ruin a gal's dreams. I'm sorry, Lotta. No, nah, it's okay. You win. I'll give you your info like I promised. Poor Lotta. Case info. So tell us the information you have. A promise is a promise, I guess. I overheard the cops around here saying something about a witness tomorrow. They said he's the caretaker at the boat rental place up at the path here. Boat rental? Oh. There's someone there? I mean, it looks so deserted. Just an old guy. All by himself. Y'all should check it out. Thanks, Lada. We will. Let's get cracking, Nick. Hold on. Something else? Yeah. The night of the murder. My camera clicked twice, you know. Wait, so you have another photo? Well, yeah, but there's nothing in it at all. Just the lake. I figured it wouldn't be much evidence, so I kept it to myself. Well, it might not be helpful at all, but here, take it. Alright, second lake photo. Bye now, y'all take care. Time for me to pack up and leave. Aw, oh, poor Lotta. Poor Lotta. It's all Larry's fault. The legend is still lives on, I guess. The legend? Yeah, the legend of Larry, familiar to all who know him of any for any length of time. When someone smells, it's usually the butts. <laughs> hmm. Someone should whip that butts in the shape. Let's look at that photo real quick. Can we look at it? Oh. It won't let us look at it. Aww. Alright, so we gotta go back here. I smell food. I want food. Boat rental. Hey, Nick! This is the boat shop that Lotta was talking about. You're right. It doesn't seem like there's anyone around at all. Let's go check it out anyway. Alright. Let's go into the caretaker shack. Meg, is that you? Eek! Hey, is that Keith with you? This is you too bad. I'm worse it. Huh? Nick, you handle this. Uh, I think I'll leave this one up to you, Maya. Meg! Yes? Finally made up your mind, have you? My, uh, my, my mind? You'll run in the pasta shop when I'm gone. The pasta shop? Glad to hear it, glad to hear it. You make your own way proud. Well, you kids left house, I didn't know what to think. How is it I supposed to keep your own place running, old man like me? Polly, the kids are home. Hello, hello, what? N Nick, what was that? A parrot, the one on the perch. Keith, yeah, yes. I live the wet noodle in your capable hands, Sonic. Nick, what's the wet noodle? Um, based on the available evidence, I'd say it's the name of his pasta shop. That's a relief, isn't it, Polly? Hello, hello, what? Hey, yep. <laughs> he fell asleep. I guess he's relieved. Uh, I'm confused. All right, well he's. All right, let's examine. Well, it's television. All right, let's look at that. Look at little safe. Hmm. It's locked. Okay. Let's examine the parrot. Wow, what an amazing parrot that is! Good morning! Hello! He's ignored me. Zzz. Ah! Wait, you forgot, Meg? You gotta call her name first. Her name? Polly, how you been? Hello, hello, what? Say? Neat, so the parrot's name is Polly. Okay. Too bad all she can say is hello. Ha 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 Oh, Polly could do lots of things. You need to know the secret words, though. Secret words? Okay. Let's talk to him. Let's talk about the pasta restaurant. This is... Ah! Ah, uh, the pasta shop? Ah, uh, yep. I think the wet noodle will live on when I come. My father started, you know? This makes you do the third generation, Meg. Y yes 
Tomorrow we'll start the secrets of dough tossing. The dough tossing? Yo, too, Keith! Yeah, yes. You'll be the best pasta wrangler the West has ever seen. For pasta wrangler? The West isn't the pasta from Italy? Meg! Yes! You know the best pasta always made from the West of the Rockets, don't you? Right, of course. Everybody knows that. Nick? Uh-huh. How long do we have to keep up this all in the family charade? This old man must know something about the murder. We're not leaving until we know what that is.